Play a piano. Now I'll quickly show you how these things work. What you have is down the bottom you have a set of pedals which you pedal like this and it opens the bellows. There's two bellows, one there and one there. So when you pedal it, the, the bellows open and they they suck the air out of the system. That's what you're doing. You're not pumping the system up, you're sucking the air out of it. You notice this box here, this is a reservoir of suction. So when you pedal it, you see how the box gets sucked in. That's because you're sucking the air out of it. When you let go, it goes out again. So you've got suction, which which is spread to the rest of the piano with these pipes, and then come up here, and some of the uh, the suction is delivered to this box here to operate the notes, and to this box here to turn to turn the roll. This is an air motor. And the suction sucks the air out of it and makes it makes it rotate purely by air suction. That's why that motor is rotating. It makes the rest rotate. That's how it all works. This side, of the pianola, this contraption here is when you put the roll on to keep the roll from going from one side to the other when it goes over this metal tracker bar that keeps it in position it's because all these little holes correspond with a note when you have when the roll passes over it like that air it uncovers these little metal, these little holes, and air, atmospheric pressure, shoots in and operates the note. And that's why the paper has to be kept perfectly in line. If it moves over to the right or moves over to the left, it won't play properly. So it has to be kept perfectly in that position to play properly. That's what that contraption does. Then this bit here contains a little set of bellows for every single note. You can see the tubes. That's where the air, is, atmospheric pressure, comes in down the, through this tracker bar and goes down these tubes into this box to operate little bellows which make each note fire. That's all there is to a pianola. This action this pianola action just sits in front of the piano action. If you undo four screws and take off the linkages, you can just remove this and you'll just have a normal piano. So which is why when you're not using the pianola mechanism, the pedals fold away and now you've got the pedals for the piano soft and loud. And now you can play it as a totally normal piano. See? Piano 
piano's got the pianola action, got nothing to do with the rest of the piano, it's completely separate. And that's all there is to a player piano. Thanks for looking.